All right, hey, what's up, everyone? This is Rios from HispanicFitness.com, and I'm doing a quick video on uh, aqua aerobics uh, and the benefits of it. Real quick, it's basically to get some exercise in the water. Uh, it's an alternative to lifting weights, to using dumbbells, and to being in a boring gym. Uh, these dumbbells offer a lot of resistance, and I highly recommend it to anyone who's uh, maybe afraid or shy to go to the gym or uh, doesn't really know. Uh, how to swim, but they want to do aerobics or exercise in the water, so I highly recommend the aqua aerobics as an alternative. Also, if you have any kind of minor injury or soreness and you don't feel like going to the gym working out, uh, this is an excellent way to get an excellent workout. Believe it or not, these dumbbells here, they don't they float, but they offer a lot of resistance, and the water also offers a lot of resistance. All right, real quick, I'm going to show you some quick exercises that you can do if you do decide to come. And, uh, Let's begin with the first uh, exercise. It's called the cross country. It's a total body exercise. Basically, I'm gonna do a few repetitions, and that's it. Pay attention. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. It's an excellent exercise. It's called the cross country. Next exercise, we're gonna run in place, and we're gonna do press downs. So basically, run in place and press down. Ready? One, two, three, four, five. Next exercise, it's like a jumping jack. Jumping jack with dumbbells submerged under water. So you're gonna open and close your legs basically and submerge the dumbbells under water. Here we go, jumping jack, under water. One, two, three, four, five. All right, real good. Now next exercise uh, I wanna demonstrate is jumping over a black line. So there's a black line here in the pool. I'm gonna jump over, forward and back over the black line. There you go. One, two, three, four, five. All right, now an alternative to that, now you can jump over that same black line side to side. I'm gonna do it again, let's begin. One, two, three, four, five. All right, so uh, it's a great exercise. Now the next exercise is uh, an exercise for a lot of people, maybe even boxers. Boxers can train in the water, believe it or not. You can do what's called punching in the water. Right? Make sure the dumbbells are submerged. You can do some uppercuts. One, two, three, four, five. You can even do some hooks in the water. Hook, 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 hook. Uh, so those are three good exercises if you're a boxer or want to be a boxer or want to train in the water. Another alternative to uh, aqua aerobics and even pretty much running is using the water to run, run back and forth. A lot of people, they want to run in the winter, but they don't want to run outside, it's too cold. So I highly recommend you use the water, run in the water. So you can do retro running, running backwards basically. It's running back all the way and running forward. And you can even do side to side, side to side, side to side. The water is very therapeutic and it's also a good stress reliever. It's an alternative to uh, running outdoors or running at a boring treadmill. And at the same time, the water hits, uh, affects, exercises a lot of the muscles in the body. All right, that's basically it for right now. Uh, in the future, I'll post another video on more aqua aerobics. Uh, if you have any questions, be uh, any comments, just reach me at hispanicfitness.com. Later.